Nina Gadiwala grew up in a North Houston suburb. One of four girls, her Persian Indian parents expected their daughters to achieve nothing less than the American dream. I definitely felt my parents had some strong expectations for us. They really had an immigrant mentality. They were so grateful to be in the U.S. They gave up a lot uh, in order for us to come here and do very well in the U.S. Nina received a Bachelor of Business Administration from the University of Texas at Austin and was the first freshman to intern at a top-tier Wall Street firm. She went on to get a Master of Arts from Dartmouth and Master of Business and Administration from the Wharton School of Business. Upon graduation, she began her career on Wall Street with the prestigious powerhouse Morgan Stanley. A lot of the investment banking culture was really, it was very much like a fraternity type culture. And so part of it was just to see, kind of test your will. It's not the kind of culture that is very open and, you know, excited by your different ideas, your different ideals. Nina's experience at Morgan Stanley inspired her to write Suits, A Woman on Wall Street, the first insider's account of the investment banking world from the perspective of a woman. Suits was a 2011 internationally acclaimed bestseller. The response was very positive. I mean, it became a bestseller very quickly. I was just amazed at how many people really, really related to it in different ways. Mostly for me, it was just having a voice uh, as somebody who is a minority, somebody who comes from a, a different background as a woman. Nina's decade of experience working for Fortune 500 companies was the catalyst for her company, MindWorks. The idea is, is to actually help people become better leaders and create a culture that is more open-minded um, in diversity issues. Nina is an international speaker on leadership, diversity, and women in the corporate world and is frequently featured in national media as an expert on business and women's issues. It's so important when you're in a place of power to actually really help other people that are not in a place of power. And that's one of the messages, whether I'm doing a speaking event or whether I'm doing some sort of corporate training, I always try and leave people with. Step up and speak up especially when you're in a place of power. Today, Nina is an industry leader for the White House and the Wall Street Journal Executive Task Force for Women in the Economy, a writer for Wharton Magazine, and a wife and mother. I really do feel I'm kind of at the sweet spot of my life because I get to talk about issues that I am most passionate about. I don't think anything can be more rewarding in terms of my career.